You already know what it is, man. It's your boy laid back with another reaction, another review, another episode. Hey, 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 look, man, make sure you hit that subscribe button and make sure you hit that notifications button as well. I would deeply appreciate it. But look, everyday struggle. What's good? Hey, look, they got a brand new layout, too, on everyday struggle. <laughs> they got it like happy holidays feel. You know, it's the Christmas vibe in the studio. So they kick off this episode and they was talking about the Migos. Now, the Migos got this new video coming out, and inside of the video, they got like a mock, you know, everyday struggle cast. And they got an academics, they got a Joe Budden, they got a Nadesco or whatever. And so this threw the whole internet in like an uproar. You know, it was just funny, 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 funny. So, you know, basically they had got into that, and, they, and actually, academics had interviewed uh, the fake Nadesca. Her name is Kiki. She's a model or something like that. So they were just clowning the desk, clowning, clowning. It was just super funny or whatever. And also, you know, Joe Budden was like, yo, pretty much he had a great year, you know. And he not taking the beef like too serious or whatever. He was saying, okay, like, so what if I actually rap at these dudes? Like, it's funny until I start with these bars. And academics was like bro then you corny you can't rap joe got upset how can i not rap against somebody that's rappers blah 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 the whole new generation thing you know whole the whole angry bitter joe thing or whatever but then they switch over to um the big shine and metro booming project and according to the internet everybody's saying this project is trash trash tritted ash i haven't heard it i haven't heard not one song off of it but based off of uh, Joe Button and Academics, they was trashing this. I mean, well, Academics said it was cool, but Joe Button was like, nah, this is horrible. The verses was horrible. The best verse on there was this female named Cash Doll. She delivered, but everybody else was pretty much trash. And they were saying that's why Big Sean is not necessarily considered in the top echelon of, of rappers that's out right now because he be having these missteps or where he could be delivering something great and he don't you know what i'm saying so that's basically what, what what they was getting at as far as why they can't compare him to the top artists like drake kendrick you know and um j cole because he'll have a great you know flash of brilliance and then he'll come back to earth and you're like man what's going on so make sure you check out that um project they said it's estimated to do like around 50 to 65 thousand i think first week so it's people out there that's gonna listen to it just because you know it's two superstars on the track you got metro Boomin that's producing everything super producer you got big sean coming through and we all know what big sean can do when he's actually in the right mode he can actually produce really really good music so they also wrapped up the episode with who has the best b for 2017 and you probably know joe button was listed in a whole bunch of beefs in 2017 <laughs> so at the end they picked you know i think it was the everyday struggle crew against the migos because it kind of lingered on throughout the whole year and um so they were just saying how you know it has so many different elements to it you know the whole blouses thing the whole uh you got left off of bad and bougie now they come back at the end of the year throwing us you know throwing them inside a video with other characters that look like them but don't look like them <laughs> you know what i'm saying so it was like a big year for everyday struggle i think this this show is like it's like a, a staple inside of hip-hop now they've been on i think probably like eight or nine months so i actually think like they they solidified themselves inside of hip-hop like they actually had a, a couple viral moments more than a couple viral moments that that spread across the whole internet they said that whole um migos and everyday struggle beef got over 500 million impressions that's ridiculous so they had a great year so far joe button you know he spearheaded the whole beef with the whole blouses thing and they still going back and forth and you can see, you can tell joe button is low-key proud that you know he's at the top of you know the beefs this year and also that is you know bringing more recognition to his name to his brand so you know he gotta love it but anyway it's your boy laid back man 
make sure you hit that subscribe button i appreciate the new subscribers how you doing welcome we're gonna grow this channel it's gonna be an awesome channel i appreciate everybody until next time you already know what it is self-love and positivity i'm out hey